Hi, welcome to Nina in the Kitchen, where today I'm making a recipe that was made up by my Aunt Louise. My Aunt Louise was the sweetest, most lovely person you'd ever want to meet, and she was a heck of a cook and a baker. So we all loved Aunt Louise. And this is a recipe that she created just for a quick weeknight side dish. So what we call them is Aunt Louise's potatoes. And here's the recipe. This is one pound of russet potatoes that I'm just cutting into a large dice. And by that, I mean I'm cutting one of these medium-sized russets into eight pieces. That goes into a pan. I have a cup of water in the pan which I'm going to salt. When you cook potatoes in water, you really do need to salt the water. And you can use any potato that you want for this recipe. The only ones I would not use are those little creamer potatoes. So what Aunt Louise did is she just basically put a large dice potato in with a large dice, if you want to call it that, onion. So this is one medium onion to one pound of potatoes. What I love about this recipe is there are so many variations you can make with this. I have one knob of butter. That's probably, it's a little more than two tablespoons of butter. There's really no recipe. This is just more technique than anything. So we have the salt in there and the butter just goes right on top of the potatoes. With a little pepper. They just toss everything just to make sure everything's seasoned and put a lid on it. And in about 15 minutes, you have this delicious side dish the onions with the potatoes its and a little bit of butter. It's so good. And over the years, I've played around with this. If you've made my braised fennel recipe, that is a delicious in here with a little cream maybe, or you don't even have to, but it really fancies it up. Um, it makes it sort of exotic. You can go with herbs, parsley, rosemary, anything that goes with potatoes. It's a great dish to know. It's a great technique to know. So I hope that you try this. I'll see you in 15 minutes when it's ready. One thing that I'd like to mention is that when you're planning on how many potatoes to feed your family or friends, the way that I was taught by my mother-in-law, and it works like a charm, is that everyone gets a medium-sized potato per person plus one. So if you have four people, you want to use five medium-sized potatoes and it works for mashed potatoes, it works for a dish like this. So I just wanted to mention that, and thank you, sis, for teaching me. It's been 10 minutes, and these are now fork tender. And by fork tender, I mean that when you push on this, they, they just break apart very easily. And as you can see, there's a fair amount of liquid left in there. So I'm going to taste for seasoning and decide if it needs any salt or pepper. And in the meantime, I'm going to boil this water down a little bit. You want it to be moist, but not wet. Put a little salt. Okay, this is perfect. You see it's wet. It's not soupy, but it's, it's moist. This is a delicious creamy side dish without using any cream. You can put a little more butter in here just to finish the dish since that's the fat that we, that we went with for this. It smells so good with the onion, the butter, the potato. Mmm. That is really delicious. So simple. So good. Thank you, Aunt Louise. We love you. Mwah. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe. 
follow me on Facebook, Twitter, blah, blah, blah. Okay, I'll see you later. Bye. <laughs>